to part two of me unboxing the things that I bought from Sephora. And I didn't say that in the last part, but I am doing a little bit of a little bit of a makeup look. So yes. And let's just not talk anymore and continue. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Okay, y'all. Before we start, we're going to start with our handy dandy headband. Okay. <clears throat> My thumb is not really in a good shape, but let me show you guys. You see like these threads that make this little like, no, juicy parts, juicy parts. Um, yeah, it's not here. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. It's been in rough times and that's okay. That's okay. And I cannot even breathe with this without this. So, oh my God, I cannot talk today. What's going on? What's going on? So, like every legend say, not to prime is a crime. So, <clears throat> sorry, I'm a little bit of a sickness over here. Um, I actually did put my e.l.f. holy hydration on before I started the video. So right now we just need a primer. You don't have to use a primer, but I personally love to be extra. Um, I actually bought this sample from Milk, like the... Hi yeah, Hydro Grip Primer, and it's really good. I'm definitely going to buy one. And I actually have this other one from Maybelline. It's the Baby Skin. This gives a matte finish, and this one gives a glossy finish. And to be honest, I do not like a matte finish look. I like glossy, so let's just go with this. And I personally always use like two pumps. And you guys, don't forget, before you do your makeup, definitely wash your hands. If you don't, you're going to have a acne skin okay. and I'll just only put this on the areas that I feel like the makeup is going to come off and like over here it's never getting off but over here in my t-zone it is my god this is so good yeah good 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 now and oh I forgot to say it's not all like from sephora some of these are from the drugstore and i just put it in this bag so yeah not all of this is from that vlog that you guys saw so let me start with our concealer and foundation or no let's start with our eyes um i actually uh, always start with my eyes because like when i do my eyes i usually do eyeliner that this that this and all of that just comes here and i do not like my and plus my hand always goes like this and no no that's not okay so let me see what do we have okay oh i actually bought a palette yeah i forgot about all of these yeah so i bought this palette from morphe and i love morphe if you didn't know i love it i do not love some of their collabs but i like this and I bought this like neutral palette. I actually had this and this is a restock. And this is such a good thing. If you want like a daily palette, like you can use every single day, but you wanna use it as a really glam type of thing sometimes. So you can go with this, you know, pretty easy. And yeah, I guess I did not buy a eye primer, which I did need. Yeah, that's good, but it's fine. Let's just get started. I'm just going to use my concealer as my primer, and I actually bought this too. This is the Best Skin Ever from Sephora. Their concealer, I'm in the shade 17.5N. Here, 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 here. And I'm gonna like put a dot. And I personally like to blend with my fingers on my lid. I do not like any brushes or beauty blenders, so it's all blended. And I'm looking here, that's because I have a mirror. Sorry. And okay, it's not opening. I believe, yeah, there's a starter shade over here. I call this a starter shade. I don't know why. Let me see what's called. Uh, wait a minute. It's called Straight Up. Yeah, we're gonna start with Straight Up. Let's go. Straight Up to the Straight Up. I need a good brush. Let me find a good brush. Found it. I'm just gonna take that and just going to pat it over my lid so it dries all 
up. Hmm, perfect. And now we're going to start. I don't know what look I'm going for actually. Yeah. I do not know what look I'm going for. Let me think. Well, you know, let me just go with a daily look. Daily. Oh no. Like a glam daily, you know what I mean? Let me let me do it. Let's just not think about it and do it. But I mean, I have other products. Wait a minute. For eyes, I actually bought a lot of stuff and I forgot about all of them. I bought this like shimmery thing for my eyes and it's for face like as well. Uh, it's from the Vanessa Marks. Vanessa Marks. I'm so sorry. I cannot read this. I'm so sorry, but yeah. It, it says it's for eyes and face. Multichrome pigment. And I've heard so much about this. It's in the shade Angel Heart. And it's really pretty. But am I gonna use this? Nah. I'm not gonna use it, but I'm gonna have a, a little bit of a swatch for you guys. I'm gonna go with it. Yeah, it's really pretty. It's really chrome and really pretty. Pretty. So let me just start with a neutral eye and then go to the pigments and glitters and stuff. Cause this actually has its own like glitters. So yeah, we're gonna start, start. Okay, I'm gonna take the shade half, half away, half away, half away. It's this really cool toned brown and not blend it yet just put it as a blob you heard me blob i love this board i love it and just go with this far okay and yeah yeah and i am actually going to blend this with another shade which this one is a warm toned brown. I actually love this mix and I'm just going to blend around it. I'm just going to go with like the whole thing with on my lid. Like so God, actually on the phone it's easier. Wait a minute. And sorry, I did not have my flashes and my ring lights today. I forgot to put them in charge, so real sorry about that. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I'll come back. With that same brush, I'm gonna take this black over here and just again put it on my corners. Do I need eyeliner at this point? Because I'm going to make this like a smoky eye. Okay, let me see if I will need eyeliner or not. I don't think so. I really do not have the physical strength right now for an eyeliner. I'm good at eyeliner, but I'm not perfect at eyeliner, you know? It takes a bit for me to figure it out. So, just blend like that. Since I want this to be quick, I'm just going to make this a winked smoky liner and come back, okay? So guys, the eyes are done, done, and yeah. Why did I repeat that? I don't know. But I actually took a small amount of time since I did this before, but yeah, it's okay. And at this point, y'all, this video have become into a makeup tutorial because this is not even like what I bought in the last video. I had this, this is the Fenty Beauty Diamond Balm Mini. I love anything mini. Don't judge me. And I'm just going to ignore every single glitter. Oh my god. That this palette has given me. It has like three, like these three. And I'm just gonna use my diamond ball. Like over here. So let's just go with it. Let's go. Oh my god. Every time it shocks me, like every time. There's no doubt that this is the best highlighter. Oh my god. But at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you guys the full look with everything, so yeah. So guys, I forgot to film that part, so sorry. But the eyes are done. I'm just going to do my base real quick. And again, the concealer from Sephora and starting that on. If you guys didn't know, I do not use any beauty blender. I actually do not like it. 
yeah I did not like it I use these pads and I use this brand I have like a lot but right now I have two over here and it's I don't know darkness darkness but you can just blend that you know it's first easier for me and second it does not eat my everything like my beauty blender oh my god eats my concealer and there's just no coverage to nothing and no meaning but with this my life have changed so let me blend that real quick um i'm oh, sorry and yeah i changed my shirt went to have dinner sorry my under eyes now i'm going to just set my under eyes with a, a translucent packed compacted setting powder this one's from revlon i do not think i feel like these are discontinued because i went to order another one and on the site it wasn't there but yeah this one like has like this and the other half has like this so i love this and you know i hit the pan i hit the pan i'm just gonna take some with my brush and just because i have a really 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 dry uh, skin so i do not really need powder and i just put this on to not crease so yeah. now i'm going with uh, my elf halo glow which is a dupe for charlotte tilbury and i have used my friends charlotte tilbury and they're totally a dupe okay totally but so yeah i just figured i'm just gonna buy this one i'm in the shade in the shade one fair shade in the one fair and yeah let's go in i'm just going to i just love this fat applicator like this is so satisfying it gives me a beautiful shine which i adore so let me just blend it and come back it's all blended you can see how glossy and like shiny my face looks i just love this type of makeup so like my face looks like a glass and and oh my god my complexion looks really good yeah of course it's gonna look really good the one day that i'm not going anywhere and have no plans my complexion and my makeup going to look that's fine and now for a blush 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 okay let me see what i have for blush um we have this rare beauty one which i actually bought another shade but that's at my friend's house so i do not have that sorry and yeah let me say it's from it's in the shade encourage i love this like purpley berry color so and i actually showed you guys this one from fenty beauty and again this was a restock i love their uh blushes and again a berry shade i didn't i do not know why did i like buy the same shades but i mean this one is more pinkish this one is more like brownish you know but yeah we're just gonna go with this one and I'm just gonna make it warm with my fingers and just gonna put a couple of dots with a lifted look i'm just going to put my blush on the top of my <clears throat> cheeks not the apples because i usually put up my nose as well but yeah today not today so i went and picked up another blush as well because i forgot i'm having a nude makeup look and i just used the most vibrant blush i could so yeah. i just got my bourgeois bourgeois um powder blush i love this this is kind of like a nude shade <clears throat> and it's kind of like metallic and look at i really want to like squash it but yeah i'm not gonna do that with my brush mermaid i'm just gonna put that and i did say i'm not gonna put my blush on the apples on my cheek but i did i never listen to myself that's one thing about me i do not and i'm just going to go crazy with this you know what i'm just gonna put it on my nose as well just a little bit here a little bit here i am not going to use bronzer today because i do not have any bronzer i believe so sorry 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 now highlighter highlighter 
For highlighter, again, I'm gonna use the <clears throat> Diamond Balm from, let me pop this with a brush. Oh my God, it's so pretty. I love it. Look at this like light though. Oh my God, it's literally just my mirror. Okay. Okay, we find, we found a source of light and that's good. Tip of my nose and the yeah, girl, slay. <clears throat> what next? <clears throat> okay, I'm going with my 24-hour brow lift from Benefit. I love this thing. This is my third time. Yeah, third time having a restock on this. I love this so much. It's a bit pricey and the elf does do the same you know the which one they both because you know elf has two like brow lifters and both they're both really good but i just want to be like oh my god i have benefit in my hands wow and i really need to cut my brows it's really the time but you know, I just love to do like this at the end and this because so it's not like spiky or anything because I do not like that effect and I was about to forget my mascara and that's really good and that's really good and yeah this is my mascara it's in a really rough shape so this is a waterproof mascara from <clears throat> Uh, Sephora again. I just love Sephora brands. Like their products are actually really good. If you guys didn't know that, so yeah. And I do not know why I'm using the waterproof, but I mean it's really good. So I'm just gonna do. God, you can really see my eyes right now. Wow, mirror, you're helping. <laughs> Perfect. And I actually do not set my face except my like mustache part. I'm just going to like do here because I touch this part a lot. It like itches a lot, so hmm. you know what? Might as well. No, I just want to keep this straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god. Okay. What next? Uh, lips. I guess we're done. Lips. We have a lot of things for lips because I bought a lot. So let me just show you guys everything that I bought for lips. Um, we can even like use these blushes, but we're not gonna do that. I bought all of these because yeah, why not? I bought this like uh, velvet lip from Clarence, and I've used it. It's pretty good, but it's not gonna go with our makeup. Um, we have this uh, Tarte Juicy Squirt Lip Gloss. Is it the lip gloss? Lip plump. And again, it's not a good shade. It's really pink. <laughs> I think none of these are a good shade for me right now. So, yeah. And I bought this play tint from Benefit and this Milk Makeup Lip Gloss and Lip Plump at the same time. Yeah, I love this. So, you know, let's just make this interesting and make a lip look with our palette and our lippies. So, yeah, let's go. Let's go. First, I have my lip liner from Rimmel London in the shade uh, 90S Nude. Yeah, I just love this like plump, plump lip look. And I'm just gonna take my eye brush again and just gonna take this really, which one should I? You guys, I have a plenty of brown lippy like lip sticks and glosses but i right now just chose to do it with my eyeshadows because it's interesting but my question is should i go with lip gloss i think i should okay i'm going to use one of these these are pink but it's fine 
but not really wide ripping. Let me use the Tarte. Oh, so cute. And for our last step, setting mist. And I actually, when I have time, when I have time, I use my setting mist and in between every single step of my makeup. That actually really helps with my makeup, like stays all day and stuff. So I didn't have the time and effort today. So you know. we have actually three choices for our setting spray. I'm just gonna use the Maybelline because that's what I always use. And I might go out tonight. I might. Woo. Okay, it went on my nose. Yeah, that's really bad. Okay, it's fine. We're fine. We're fine. Yeah, we're really fine. Oh my god. Yeah, we're fine. Um, let me just do a outlook for you guys and just get ready. Put some earrings, put some necklaces, and show you guys the end product. And yeah, let's go. Huh? So guys, what do you think? I personally love this look right now. And just to like walk, I'm going to go out. Yeah, I am doing that. And I feel like i'm sorry there's a mirror over here i'm just letting myself and i feel like i'm really happy with my purchases like that nude palette i really need it so what do you think but i feel like this look could have used a little bit of a bronzer but you know you know so guys this was the end of our video and let me just no it's good it's good stay there honey this was the end of our video if you guys like this video definitely in the tell me in the comments if you guys want more videos like this again tell me in the comments and this was such a joyable video i actually loved doing like this makeup in front of the camera and you guys and yeah is there anything else to say don't forget to subscribe share this video and hit that subscribe and bell button I said subscribe two times, you know, you know, do whatever you want, but yeah, thanks for watching, bye!